This is a gesture drawing demonstration. Here we have a wooden figure, a human figure, and what you want to do is just really establish the overall movement or position of the figure. Sometimes it's a line right down the middle. Uh, depending on the, the shape or the form, you want to just really capture the overall movement or feeling of the object that you're drawing as quickly as possible. What you want to avoid are contours. You want to work inside and out. Eventually you will put some contour line in there, but you really want to focus more on the general shapes. Don't worry at all about detail. Don't think about it as drawing from the top to the bottom or from the left from the right. Work all over. Keep skipping around, making adjustments as you go. Don't worry about any mistakes at all. It's a process of making adjustments. Don't think about it as mistakes. What you want to do is put down a line with lots of confidence, create a, a, a volume, a shape, and then make adjustments, re-evaluate. It's a continual process of re-evaluation. There's no mistakes at all in this. That's why I like to draw with a Sharpie marker or something that's a little bit more permanent. Don't even think about using an eraser. It's something really quick. This is only a two minute drawing. Sometimes you want to do a little 30 second or one minute drawing, but a gesture drawing really should be done in, in a matter of two to five minutes at the very most. I think five minutes is probably too long. So basically just start putting down estimates, start looking at uh, where the middle is. You might want to start out by just creating how big you think it is from top to bottom, make a couple little marks top and bottom and the width, and then make adjustments as you go. The, the key is look at your object more than your paper, draw with your arm, don't draw with your wrist.